Turns out one local choir is now headed to Vatican City. Singers at Sacramento's Sacred Heart Church got a special invitation to perform at the 500th anniversary celebration of the Papal Choir. News 10's Lee Painter had the chance to hear for herself just how beautiful their voices are. We join her now live at Sacred Heart Church. Lee. Oh, you guys, it was so beautiful. It gave me shivers and just in the practice room, you could just feel the vibrations off the walls. That's how powerful their voices are. And this choir is made up of of attorneys, of baristas, of students, of retirees, and some aren't even Catholic. They're just a group of people that have this amazing talent individually, but when they come together, it's just magical. Late Sunday afternoon, people file into Sacred Heart Church, not for mass, but to hear the Scola Cantorum. For us, it's a beautiful way to pray. It's wonderful being part of such a uh, devoted and um, special group of people. The 35 member choir is so impressive, they were personally asked by the Vatican's chapel master to perform for the new pope at the 500th anniversary celebration of the papal choir in Rome this June, an honor bestowed upon them for the second time. They performed for Pope Benedict in 2007. And when you look down the nave, when you're on the great altar of St. Peter's and you look all the way down to the end of St. Peter's, it keeps you humble and it truly is a spiritual experience. Under the direction of Don Kendrick, the choir has toured around the world, practicing every Wednesday night. Many of the singers were hand-picked by Kendrick to join the choir. It's a collection of attorneys, baristas, retirees and students who say they found their true voice with Kendrick. And we were at um, this opera singer's house, and Dawn had asked if any of us wanted to prepare a piece to sing for her. And so I did, and I remember that I wanted to impress her so much that the sound came out of me that I had never sung that powerfully before. And I just remember, like, being so shocked. So ever since then, I've been singing that way. <laughs> Each is talented, but together, the experience hearing them perform is magical. They say it's an opportunity to communicate with God while experiencing a wide range of emotions within mere minutes. <laughs> I don't know how to explain it, but uh, it, it's very, you, you get a very sense of, you know, a, a really accomplishment and say, you know, that this just sounds so beautiful. You just, you kind of transfix there, you know. And it's phenomenal. And to do it with 35 other people who believe in this all-powerful, loving, merciful God, it's an incredible moment. And you feel like you're one person. Scola Cantorum will share its gift with the Vatican this June. Oh, now I am, I apologize. My photographer, Amy, and I, we tried our best to really capture for you how amazing this choir is, but uh, you, you have to see it for yourself. So if you come out on June 2nd, they're having another concert before they leave for Italy. We're live in Sacramento, Lee Painter, News 10.